but let's say I am gay, but I'm acting like a man. It's like you can still, you can be, you can like men and still act like a man. Just because you're gay doesn't mean that you have to act like a female. That's my problem with it. You understand? It's like you don't have to be flamboyant and this time the third all. You know what I mean? And it's the same shit with like girls. It's like you don't have to act like a man when you're a woman. You know what I mean? It's like it doesn't make sense to me, bro. And that's that's the problem that I have with it. It's like, bro, there's so many people that are out there that are flamboyant when it's like, yo, you could just be gay and like men. I mean, you could just be, you could act like a regular guy and just, like, just act, just act normal. You don't have to like be flamboyant and shit. Like it, that shit, that makes no sense to me. I'll be real honest with you. Like, and you can say whatever you want, but it just, I, it just doesn't make sense, bro. But you can go, go ahead. No one's saying they have to be a particular way. And again, uh, you're saying normal p person, right? W why are you inferring that people who are gay are not normal? One, two, you're saying you're saying that there are like people who are gay that just act this particular way. There are people who are straight that act in a feminine manner who are men. Okay, that doesn't mean that there's anything wrong. There's something wrong with a man acting like somewhat feminine who's straight. I'm sorry, can you repeat that? What's the last thing you Is said? Is there anything wrong about a man acting somewhat feminine who's straight? Man, I mean, bro, it's just like, why? What's the need for it? And no, is there anything wrong with that? What's the need for it? It's not what's is there anything. Wrong? Is there anything wrong with it? But that's my question to your question. What's the need for it? Like, what, what are you? Why what, do you what, what is the need for boys? someone to play Fortnite? I'm not gonna lie. That makes no sense. We're not talking about Fortnite. We're talking about. Or I know you're just saying like the reason why you're gonna say that it's wrong is because there's no need for it. Right. There's no need for me to play Fortnite. Therefore, it's wrong for me to play Fortnite then. Dude, I'm not gonna lie, that makes no sense, bro. We're talking yeah, about- Yeah, exactly. Your reasoning makes no sense. Thank you very much. How does the reasoning not make any sense? Well, because I just applied it to another scenario and you said it made no sense. But that's the thing. Why do gay people feel like they have to act a certain way to be gay? They can just be- They don't. They, they don't. Gay people don't they... feel like they have to what act feminine to okay, be gay. So what's the point of- no, Right? That just happens to be the case that some- Hold up, hold up. Right? Hold what's up, the point of hold up, hold up. Dress? If it happened it just it just happens Isn't to be the case that please. hold up let me finish it just happens to be the case that some people who are gay act somewhat feminine the same way some people who are straight act somewhat feminine right there's no claim that people who are gay have to act feminine no one's making that claim right most gay people are not like extremely feminine presenting who are men right It's not about that, bro. You're like, I feel like when I'm bringing up good points, you're just deflecting. It's like, see, that's not... I, what did I, I came, deflect look, from? I just look, answered. I came up here and I told you that, you know, I don't have a problem with them. I just have a problem with the way that they're pushing the agenda. It's like, yo, you can just like... like Wait, what agenda? All right, come on, bro. Let's not sit here and act like you don't see the agenda everywhere, bro. No, no, I'm asking come you on. what particular agenda are Let's you be, referencing? Okay, okay, let me put it like this. I used to work in a school, right? I used to work in a school about a year ago. And mind you, when we were growing up, right? Th this is my main problem with it. Fuck all the fan blowing shit. Fuck all the dead people eating, out, eating each other out at Pride events because it's a Pride event. That's just ridiculous. But let's talk about- Again, we address all those claims and you just literally didn't acknowledge any of them. I gave you responses to these, right? The one what that you just you referenced, that's about? literally considered everything. illegal already under law, right? Two, when it relates to uh, people who are straight, people who are straight have done that same exact thing that you're referencing. Three, those particular things happen within events in which are strictly 18 plus. This was not around children. If it was around children, okay. again, we're going to say that's completely bad, but that is not representative of Pride events. It's not representative of gay people. Wait, so has on, nothing wait, to do with can that. Can I ask you a question? Can I ask you a question? So you said that if it's around children, it's bad, right? Yeah, clearly. Okay, so when it gets like 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 people nude well, in front of children, I think it's bad. Gets, when it gets recorded, right? When it gets recorded and it gets posted to the internet, is that not around children? Are children not seen? Um, yeah, so I think that I think that we should have barriers that do not allow for children to see this type of stuff. Like on these different types of social media platforms, there are manners to take this stuff down from social media. Two, there can be different types of algorithms that are set up to in, 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 uh, ensure that people who are younger or are engaging with what, what is typically considered what younger people are engaging with in terms of content, they're just not going to get uh, stuff like this on their for you pages at all. They're not going to get stuff like this on their algorithms. Next, it's also the, fo the 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 responsibility of the parents to ensure that their kid is not in all of the extra stuff, right? Seeing all this type of stuff. But it is the case that some children are going to see these things, right? But the point is that we want to limit these things from happening, and in public, that's a place where we can limit them. Right? No, yeah, for sure. But that you know that that was my main problem with it. But my main problem, right? The one that I was saying before, before uh, you know we started going into this, was I used to work in a school, right? And mind you, when we were growing up, let me ask you a question. How, how old are you? 21. Okay, so you're about a year ahead of me. So you were great above me. When we were growing up, did we, did we uh, you know, when we were in like, what, first, second grade, did we like, you know, fuck around and, and draw and shit and, and do whatever the TV, you know, we just fucked around, right? We, we, we lived as kids, right? We went outside, we did recess, we ate lunch, we cracked jokes, we did this, we did that, right? 
answer me. I mean, we grew up differently, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna ask you, but why is it nowadays that when I'm working in the school, I'm walking through the fucking building and I'm seeing posters, oh, this is my sexuality, and they're fucking eight years old. Is that, that's not a problem to you? Like, these kids can't sit down and play with Wait, do you accept gay people? Right, I see nothing God. wrong with Can accepting gay people. Can I finish? Can I finish? Can I finish? Why, why can't these kids sit down and play with toys like how we grew up? Why do they have to be eight years old and talk about sexuality? Why is that the world that we have to um, go Because through? Because and these things impact... With that? You genuinely don't see a problem with that. Can I respond? Yo, you can respond. My boy, you can respond 100%. But I don't want you to deflect. I want you to answer me 100% honestly. I am answering 100% honestly. I'm, honestly. I'm, re I'm, re I'm trying to respond, but you're, you keep talking. All right, my fault. Go ahead. Okay, right. So children by the age of like generally five, six, seven, eight years old, right? They're going to know, right, whether or not they're straight or gay in many circumstances. I knew that I was straight, right? When I was five years old, I had a crush on another girl in the classroom. These things are relevant to kids' self-expression, right? It is the case that I knew that along with the notion that I played with toys, I played with trucks, I ran outside, I did all that extra stuff, right? It is the case that you could do all the extra stuff that you just referenced in terms of being a kid and then also accept gay people. And acknowledge gay people exist. That's it. It's not about, it's not about, oh, we're talking about engaging in intercourse with children. We're saying some boys like boys, some girls like girls, and some boys like girls, and some girls like boys. That's it. Yeah, but there's that's nothing, all that's being said. No, for sure. And there's nothing wrong with that, though. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. There's nothing fucking I'm wrong not, with that. I'm not saying there's nothing wrong with that. What my problem is, is like, why do you have to push it on the kids? Let kids grow up and be kids like how we No, no, that's not pushing kids. it. That's just saying accept. That's it. Bro, there's, that's not, not pushing. there's nothing as accepting it. Like... They're, what are you bro, talking I'm, about bro they're eight years old making projects about sexuality they're eight and then then, then they got to what projects to, about sexuality bro, let me ask you something you said panic wait 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 what, what wait, projects about sexuality no 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 i want you to answer my what, question what, first hey, what ahead, projects about question, sexuality bro. what's up what's up what'd you say what projects about sexuality bro there's posters up on the wall if you want i can send you the picture i took the picture myself no tell me what project bro the picture is on the wall it says, or it says, it's questioning people about their sexuality. Let me pull. There's a picture on the wall that literally like says it's okay to be gay, right? And that's somehow that's somehow like a project that's being forced, mandated on children so that they can like express their sexuality. N none of that is. I mean, you didn't justify that. Posters and projects are not the same. But in the meantime, everyone keep tapping that screen. Let's try to get to a million likes. If you want to help get it out to more people, share the live. Let's try to get to 1.5 thousand shares, 2,000 shares. We'll help get it out to more people. If you like my content, follow me if you haven't already. He's looking up something right now. By the way, I can't hear you when you're looking up stuff. You're paused. Just letting you know. Right. Um, but yeah. Huh? I hear you now. All right, no problem. So the picture's on the wall, right? And it's talking about being gay, asking yourself, are you gay? You know, asking yourself, what, are, what am I? Is it okay to be this? Is it okay to be that? It's like, yo, bro, why can't they just grow up and just live? And then wait, wait, what? No, tell me particularly why, what it I said. Like, like, turn your camera on I right now and show me. what it said. I just told you what it said. No, I don't no, no, have no. the picture anymore. I deleted it. You don't it. have the picture? I worked, okay. I there a year ago. You can think I'm lying, whatever. I really don't, I really don't give a fuck. I don't, I, I don't think you're lying, right? I'm just saying that's not a project, right? That's literally just like, it's a thing on the wall that says it's okay to be gay. Okay, Christian the Coral, Thank you so much. It's a poster. Okay, let me ask you something. You see it? You see Are you against anti bullying posters? That's not the same thing at all. Why are you like, forcing that on what children? What are you talking about? That's not the same thing at all. You're bringing up. I, I never said it was the exact same thing. I'm asking you. Your whole, right? Are you against like, this? All right, look, 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 look. Hold on, hold on. Let, let, let's just hold on. Okay, so look, let me finish what I was saying, right? So these kids are seeing the stuff on the wall, right? And they're not even like able to like, they see it, right? And then they're going to go home and ask their parents about it. You said par parents, that's their job to monitor what they see, right? Well, let me tell you something. When, par when parents let their kids into the school, that is out of the equation. The school is going to show them whatever they show them. And you know who pushes the school? Guess who pushes the school? Guess who funds the school? And guess who's who pushed the agenda? Wait, can I ask you a question? Are you against the Bible being in elementary schools? Um, no, I think it should be in because when they took God... You think it school, should be? You know there's ask, fucking more about sex in the Bible ask, sorry, than there is about sex no, no, when you no, no, just no, related no, to that? Boy, if you boy, fucking read boy. the Bible... Hold up. Let if you've read the Bible... You're hey, hold up, hold up. Let me let me finish. Let me finish. If you have... If, no, 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 no. Let me finish. Hey, let me finish. You're an atheist and I'm a Christian. I don't care. I'm gonna do it. There's no If you don't let me do it, I'm gonna mute you, man. Would you let me do it? Oh my god, you're gonna mute me. Go ahead. Whatever. Yeah, I normally don't mute people. I don't like muting people. But if you're not gonna let me speak in response to this and finish this point, I'm gonna mute. Go ahead, bro. Okay, so th there's way more sexual stuff in the Bible, if you've actually read it, than there is in any book that is being given to children, any poster that you just referenced, right? Way more about sex. So if you're not, if you're not right, for getting rid of the Bible in elementary schools, then what the fuck are you saying? How do you think, how, how you think he was born? What? 
How do you think he was born? Who? By two, by two females or by two, uh, by two men? Who? You. How do you think me and you and everybody me, else? Male, male and before? female engaged in intercourse, right? For most people. Other okay, people, right? So IVF. Other people, artificial insemination, right? And they could have a gay parent. No problem. I'm not even going to bring up the point of, of reproduction because then you're going to bring up that infertile shit, which I think is just bullshit. That shit makes no sense whatsoever. If then you, make the argument but, and but, let's but run it through. Are you bringing up, but this is my question, though. It's like, why are you bringing up religion when I'm a Christian and you're an atheist? We don't agree. We don't agree at all. Because you're, yeah, because I think you have just, an unjustified bro, premise atheist, for your position. All right, look, look, look. This is the way I see all atheism, right? <laughs> Man. All right, look. And, and I look. It's like a protest to what I believe in. It's solely built on going against God, is it not? Um, I, I can't go against something that I don't believe exists. So if you believe, so wait, Tama, do atheists believe in the devil? Uh, no. Can't hear you, you're paused right now, by the way. In the meantime, tap that screen, everyone. Let's try to get to a million likes. If you want to help get it out to more people, share the live. Let's try to get to 2,000 shares, everyone. Follow me if you haven't already, y'all. Okay, so, dude, but just answer me that question. Do they? Do they what? Sorry? The question that, the question that I asked you before. Yeah, I, I, can you restate it? Oh, yeah, my fault. All right, so look, look. So, so do atheists, like, what, what do atheists do? Like, well, what, is, what is your normal day in the life as atheists? That's my question. No, your question was about the devil, right? Yeah, so do you believe yeah, in the devil? No, I don't fucking believe in the devil. So what do atheists believe in? Uh, depends what you're talking about. In terms of why we exist, generally speaking, it's I don't know why we exist. Like, like, I don't know what led to us existing, right? That's what I'm trying to say. Oh, man, well, I mean, dude, I can't, like, that, that's the problem. It's like, it's like whatever I try to say about the Bible, you're just going to disagree with me. So what's the point of bringing up the Bible and arguing about, about is why gay or straight okay? I well, gave you, you my you, point. You don't have my to, point. right? But I'm, I'm not, I'm not, I didn't actually even, even ask you for your justification, right? I just asked you if you think it, it should be in school systems, right? No, and but you said you're it should be in school up, systems, even though, wait, hold up. You said it should be in school systems, even though there's way more sexually explicit content within the context of the Bible than any poster you just reconciled with or any person that is acknowledging and accepting gay people. Mm -hmm. No, but my problem is, right? What's the point of bringing up religion when we're talking about gay and straight? I literally people? just told you. I just told you, Min, did you hear me? Because you're not against getting rid of the Bible, even though it has more sexually explicit content. That makes no sense. What's sexual, bro? Yeah, of reproduction, of how we got here. That's what they believe in. That's what, that's what people believe in that are religious. They, re they believe that we got here from a woman and a man. That's the same thing. So let me ask you something. Is being gay a religion? Because that's essentially um, no. what you're saying. No, it's like no, you're, because you bring up. No, I'm not. I'm not a gay argument. Men, men, men. You know, I, you know, you I, I actually, I actually explained to you multiple times at this point, right? Why I'm bringing it in. Okay, you were bringing up a point against gay people, saying that we shouldn't accept gay people or normalize gay people in in, in school systems. Why? Because it's pushing sexual stuff on children. Or even though you're okay with that straight type of stuff ta being talked about in schools, or even in the context of the Bible, there's rape in the Bible, right? There's so much sexually explicit stuff within the context mm -hmm. of the Bible. Yet you don't reference that you don't acknowledge that and you think that that should be in elementary school systems i'm comparing I mean, it on the basis of there being sexually explicit content not on the basis of it being a religion you're misunderstanding the context of the analogy no no look, look, i get what you i understand what you're saying now but with all due respect that's just the way life is do gay do 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 two gay people or men or women do they bring us here no um, wait gay, gay people can right but like uh, when it relates to this not through How intercourse can gay, right I, a, a gay man oh, hold up there, bro can, really? I, can i finish Go ahead. I just want to hear what you have to say. That yeah, two males engaging in intercourse cannot produce inter uh, produce a child by engaging in intercourse. Exactly. Right? You can produce a child, right, biologically speaking, right, through IVF, in vitro fertilization, right, artificial insemination, other stuff like that that can produce children through a biological manner, right, or you could have a biological kid but is that while being while being like a like an adult who's gay. And we get here. Is that what that is? Is that the same thing? Uh, it doesn't have to be that way. Artificial insemination and um, and IVF don't include two people engaging in intercourse. Okay, but you're not answering my question. You're just bringing up. You know, I did just answer your bullshit, question. But it's like, where, do gay people or lesbian people do they bring humans here without scientific shit? Like, okay, so two people engaging in intercourse, right? Two gay people who are two males, right? They engage in intercourse. It's not going to produce children. I've already said that. Right? Okay. But just because it doesn't produce children doesn't mean it's wrong. Do you think that oral sex is wrong? 
Do I think that oral sex is wrong? I think if you want to fucking have sex, you have sex. It doesn't really fucking matter. No, is oral sex wrong? Answer my damn question. No, I'm, but I am. I'm answering your question. No, you're not. Answer my question. Have, yes or no? Sex wrong? No. It's, why would it? No, be it's not wrong. It doesn't reproduce though. There's no bro, reproduction from that. this is the same shit that you're saying about all oh, the infertile woman, this and the third, bro. We're talking about how me and you got here. Did I say that a woman and a man having sex is wrong? No, people do that all the time. People are doing that right now as we speak. There's nothing. But you said that wrong. gay intercourse is wrong because it doesn't lead to reproduction. Bro, I gave you a scenario did, where two straight, straight no, no, people no, no, are no, engaging no, in, in intercourse, putting, right? Like, and it's not words wrong, words even out. though it doesn't lead to reproduction. Bro, you're putting words in my mouth. Hold on, because I never said that it was wrong. I went, what's the first thing that I said when I came up here? I said I don't. 100% believe that it's wrong, but I believe that the stuff that they're doing around it is wrong. Like the people. No, that... you do. You did say that you think it's wrong, right? Like multiple times oh, in this conversation. This I have this nice. recorded. You can watch this on YouTube when it's posted later. Okay. Oh yeah, no problem. I definitely will. My 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 thing about it is just like, bro. It's like, like I said to you earlier. It's like you know I try to come up here and be lenient. It's like, you can be gay, right? And you can just live your life. You don't have to make it known that you're gay. That's my problem. Yeah, you can be straight and live your life. You don't have to yes, go on a live man, in front of 6,000 people and say it's wrong to be gay. You're wait, 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 wait. Bro, if you're, you're straight, wait, 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 wait. Min, no, you're making you. my point. Here, I'm going to mute you because you're making my point, right? And I want, I want you to reference this, okay? You can just be straight. Instead of going on a live in front of 6,000 people and saying it's wrong to be gay, just be straight. Just be straight. Use the same reasoning for yourself, buddy. Just be straight. Just be straight. Don't try to force it on everyone else. Come on, bro. You can unmute yourself, by the way. I unmuted you, bro. Tap that screen in the meantime. Let's try to get to a million likes. If you want to help get out to more people, look, share the live. Everyone, look, let's look, try to get to uh, 2,000 shares, y'all. Look, 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 look. This, is, this is my entire point in a nutshell, bro. Because earlier I came up here and I told you whatever the fuck I told you, right? So listen, my whole point in a nutshell is, bro, you can be gay and live your life, right? But you don't, like, and I can be straight, just like you said. You proved my point, too. I can be gay. I mean, I can be straight and live my life. Just, just, just live your life. You don't have to make it, like, you don't have to make it such a known thing that you're gay. Bro, just be gay. Like, that's fine. That's yeah, you don't have to make it such a known thing that you're against people who are gay. Just be straight. I'm not Thank against Thank you for the hand art. I appreciate it. Thank you for the hand I'm not against people that are gay. People can't be gay. Well, then why are you coming on a live saying it's wrong to be gay? Appreciate because the Because I don't like you. the shit that they're pushing around it. Okay, so again, right? The idea is that you can just be straight. You can just be straight. You don't see the posters that they're holding trying to get these kids. Like you don't. Oh come on, saying it's acceptable to be gay. You're literally okay with the Bible. With the Bible, men, men, men. You're okay with the Bible being in elementary schools, even though there's significantly more sexually explicit content. There's rape in the Bible. Ace, I appreciate the subscription. Thank you so much. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. You're so against God, yo. Man, one day you're gonna find out. But let me tell you something. I'm not against. I'm not against God because I don't believe God exists. But let me tell you something though. When they took God out the schools, guess who they let in? Guess who they let in? What do you mean took God out of the schools? When they took the Bible, right? And they took all the sayings when, when we used to get out of our seats and say whatever we said. Who do you think they let in? Into the schools. I'm confused what you're saying. The Bible is still in schools. The Bible is not in schools. I worked in a school. The Bible was 100. I literally, I literally, when I was a kid, right, there was literally a Bible yeah, at my school. when you were a kid. Yeah, and how long ago school. was that? How long ago was that? This was like less than, less than a decade and a half ago. Uh, and sadly, I was working with fucking 13 year olds, right? So I was there re more recently, right? I'm just saying, that's what I'm saying. And don't try to twist my words, bro. I don't hate gay people. I like gay people. Like, I don't have a fucking problem with them. I just don't like how, like, it, it's, it has to be such a push thing. It's like, yo, just be gay. I don't give a fuck. Like, that's, that's fine. You're gay. Come here. Give me a dab. Like, you know what I mean? It's, it doesn't have to be. Yo, I'm gay. Let me walk around in a fucking dress or Yeah, so there 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 there, there, there are finish. Bibles allowed in allowed in finish? public can I schools. Can I finish? Appreciate no, you. I'm just I'm just clarifying right, the no point. There I are I appreciate, there you. Are... I appreciate you. Yeah, no problem, no problem. Look. So you got people walking around in tights with their fucking ball sacks out, and you don't see that as a problem? Yeah, so I think no, I think that on, there would there's guy. wrong with like showing sexually explicit stuff to minors and stuff like Bro, that. 100%. If people in adult wait in an eighteen plus setting, right? Only eighteen plus setting are wearing stuff like that. I don't have an issue with it. And in only 18 plus setting. And people in, hold on, my fault. I know I'm arguing with you, whatever, or debating with you, but people in the comments saying I force religion. I don't force shit on nobody, bro. I saw it. No, man, but can you respond to my point, right? Like the, the point I made earlier, you right? You, you were you saying that you can just be gay, right? Don't go in front of everyone and say it, right? You can just be straight. Don't go in front of 7,000 people. I appreciate they had a mustache. Thank you so much. And say that being gay is wrong on a live then, right? Not you're using your same reasoning.
For sure. No, that's a fact. But you're like, we're not even proving a point at that point. We're just saying. We are. We are. We're point. showing how you're being hypocritical. Bro, how am I being hypocritical? Honestly, I'm not even... Because you're saying not to go in front of people and express the fact that you're gay, but you're going in front of people expressing the fact that you're straight and saying it's wrong to be gay, right? That's when literally what I you're doing in front of fucking 7,000 people. When did I look, When did I say it was wrong to be I gay? I have this recorded. It's going to be on live later on. That's fucking perfect. I would love to watch it over because I want to see when I said it was wrong to be gay. I said it was wrong to just push it in front of people's faces when it doesn't have to be like that. My guy, you could be gay and go out in a fucking cargo sweatsuit and loose ass pants and be the flyest gay dude I've ever seen in my life. And I'll be like, damn, he's fly as fuck. You don't have to go outside when you're a man wearing fucking tights and your fucking balls are dangling. Like, do, do you at least understand that part? That's not applicable I, to just gay people. There are straight people Jesus that do Christ. the exact same thing. Jesus Christ. I've never seen a straight man with tights on, so you're bugging. You're bugging. My That's God, cap. Bugging. That's cap, bro. What are you talking about? Thing, I've never seen that shit. What are you I've talking about, bro? You're bugging. Big bugging. Dude, do you not, do you not know Halloween costumes in which are tights? Bro, Men wear that all that? the time. Like, what are you talking about? Who does Yeah, there was that? like, the, there was like, no, you know, like the green tight suit or ballet. Like, uh, come on, guy. Like, bro, come on. Like, you're, t no, bro. I know what I'm talking about. There's people and like, it's like, oh my God. How could, like, bro, I'm agreeing with you to a certain extent. How could you not agree with me to the fact that people are walking outside in tights and their balls are dangling in front of everybody? And I'm saying it's not specific to gay people. But I was, bro, that is very specific to gay no, people. No, it's not Because specific. if you're a man and you wear tights, that's gay. That's, no, it isn't. What the and, fuck? And guy, what, wait, 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 wait. wait. Men, men, what thing. does it mean to be gay? No, no, no. I, I, Tell I, I, me I, I, what, I, I, what it means to be gay. But I'm going to answer your question because you keep... No, no, no. I'm going to mute you if you don't answer my damn question right now, okay? Like, bro, like 7,000 people, yeah, sure. All right, can you can you tell me what it means to be gay, men? I want you to tell me what it means to be gay. What it means to be gay? Uh, to me, what it means to be gay? That's what you're asking me. What it means to be gay? Yeah, sure, easy. If you're a man, you like a man, you're gay. If you're a woman, you have sexual arousal towards men. All right. If you're if a man, you're a woman, okay. Wait, finish, if that is the case, me wearing wait, you're men, me men. For my definition, and I'm not asking you for yours just yet. Okay. So me engaging in intercourse, right, with women, right, me being attracted to women, right, that can be true at the same time of me wearing tights. I could wear tights and still be straight. So what about someone wearing tights indicates that they are gay when, again, that relates to the attraction? So if you wore tights right now, would you be gay? I, by the way, I can't invite you. You can turn off your uh, mute, though. I can't invite you for 15 seconds to unmute. Like men wear Speedos. Like what about, what about Michael Phelps? Phelps. I can't even say his last name, but Michael Phelps, right? He, Speedos, swimming. Gymnasts, ballet, musical theater, football players. You can unmute yourself. Perfect guy, look. Bro, we're not, that's talking about, you're talking about sports when that's a uniform. That's been a thing since forever, bro. That's been a thing since forever. That's not a thing. We're talking about a man, right? And this is the question right here. Okay, so it's okay when they do Wait, it, but on, not okay. So are they, are, are they gay? Are they gay? Are they gay? You can hear me? Yeah, are they gay? Oh, you gay me. Are they gay? I bet. Look, look. For wearing those uniforms, are they gay? Um, no, but if you're a man walking outside... No, so wait, wait, so wearing tights doesn't make them gay? Um, no, wearing tights and having your balls swinging, yeah, that definitely makes you gay, bro. For sure it makes you gay, but... Oh, so someone gay. wearing you know, a Speedo like Michael Phillips, he's gay? He's wearing a uniform. That's been a thing but, since but, the but, 80s. But the point is, is that he's dangling, dangling those things around. Um, yeah, but not by choice. I'm sure if he could wear some extra long shorts, my boy wouldn't mind doing that, but I'm not going to speak for something. No, no, else. he still wouldn't because that would actually reduce his ability to be able to go faster within the pool. Bro, I don't, I'm not talking about swimming though. I'm talking about you are, okay, okay, let's, let's stick to the, let's stick to the point here, bro. You're walking outside, right? And this is, but this is the thing though. We have two different definitions of gay. It's like for everything I say, you have a contradiction. You can't argue with people like you. I'm saying that you're a man. And you walk outside in tights. That's very feminine, is it not? That doesn't make it gay. How does if that I paint my gay? nails? Am I gay? Oh, for sure. That's not even something that I'm like. That yo, I, I can't. What? I don't know. We can't. Dude, I've literally painted my nails before. I'm not gay. Shit, you're very feminine. Then I don't know what to tell you, bro. So what about that's gay? The fact that that is a woman thing to do, and you're doing a woman thing to do. Okay, what, what does it mean, a woman thing to do? So you're just saying anything that's feminine, right? Yeah, for sure. So if men, do you think long hair is feminine? 
do I think long hair is feminine? I think a lot of guys have long hair, and I don't think that's feminine. I think a lot of you don't guys... think it's feminine. Okay. Wait, let me ask you something. So before before barbers and shit, right? So you think you think uh, like cavemen and shit? You think they didn't have long hair? They okay. did have long hair, right. right? I'm just right. saying, typically speaking, okay. in our society okay. right no, 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 now. Hold up, let me let me finish. Because you me... can't bring up Jesus Christ and then bring up society. You yeah, so can I can I finish? Can no, I finish? Typically sure. speaking, finish. typically no, speaking within our society, right? It is the case that women have longer hair, right? That's why it's considered a feminine characteristic, is because it's typically associated with the female sex, right? It is the case that men used to wear dresses, right? And that was the case that it was considered masculine within that context. They used to wear tights, and that was considered masculine within that context. Many different cultures in which that was the case. Wigs? Well, founding fathers? I mean that's just shit from back in the day. I mean we're talking about if wait. So gonna... so were they were they gay? Were the founding fathers all gay? I don't know. Shit. Did, could you tell me? Were you there? Do you know if they? No, they, they, they were not all you, gay. Do you know? Do you know if they were gay? No, they they were not all gay. We know that based upon probability. But do we know that based upon if we were there or not? Okay. I don't have to be there to know that, right? Do you have? Do you need to be there to know that George Washington existed? No. Do you need to be right on Mars to know that Mars exists? No. Do you need to go to uh, Andromeda Galaxy to know Andromeda Galaxy exists? No. Oh my God! Wow, you are hilarious. We're talking about you're talking about existing, and I'm talking about actions. We're talking about two different things here, bro. You understand? Uh, I don't know what your point is. How do you see? I don't understand this, right? So it's like you bring up a point, shit. I agree with you. I'm like, okay, you know what? I can see that. But it's like when I bring up some valid shit, it's like you're like, oh, I don't fucking know. You know, I can't. I don't know where your point is. Like, come on. So bro. I disagree it's with like, you, and that's somehow wrong with me. Right, it's because you wrong, agree with me and I didn't agree with you. It's just right? like, bro, it just doesn't make I'm sense. I'm not going like, to just concede to your point, you, right? If you give you me a good understand? point, I will concede. How do you know? Okay, but I'm making good points. Like, I'm trying to tell you. It's no, like, you're not. You're bringing up, you're bringing up, like, I'm bringing up actions and you're bringing up existence. Do okay, you so, know, so what do you mean by actions? Do you know if George Washington was gay? Do you know that for sure? Because he wore a wig? By the way, being gay is not an action. Being gay is a desire that they have. Right. Um, okay, so if you we, we li likely yeah, speaking have evidence to indicate that George Washington was not gay. I appreciate the cap. Thank you so much. All right, we have we likely speaking evidence. Okay, yeah, I mean, bro, it's but why are we talking mustache, about? Thank you. But I'm just confused. It's like why are we talking about George Washington when my point in the first place was it's being pushed in schools and these kids are like having to make a choice between their sexuality before they could even appreciate pick the up cap. Thank you. No, you they don't. They, you don't make a choice with your sexuality. It is the case that you just have a sexuality, right? Come on, bro. This is no, no. no I'm not joking, right? Can you? No, did you choose you know to be what? straight? That's actually no, no. That's a that that that's a point that you have, but it's a very loose point because was Caitlyn Jenner always attracted to males, or was he? Was, or was he? Or was he fucking on uh, Chris Jenner? She, she, she. Was she? Whatever, bro. Whatever. I, I don't you know, know what they were attracted you know to. I don't. I don't know what she so, was attracted so to. Therefore, is it not a choice? Did he not make a choice mid sixties of his life? Did she? Whatever you want to call her, did did she not make a choice mid sixties? And we're talking about him at the time. So we're talking about him, at the time. Did Still he true. not make the choice to transfer into a woman, right? So he made. So that, th that was the outside outward perception. Choice. You're saying, oh, they're born like that, bro. They make. Hold up. By the way, by the way, this wrong. doesn't relate to. Hold up, can I, can I explain? Wrong with the choice. Appreciate the sunglasses, thank you so much. You're, you're completely misunderstanding. So first off, right, being trans is not being gay. Identity and sexuality, completely different things when it relates to this context. Two, right, the, the notion in which you consider them to be a woman, right, that's your perceived notion of them, right? It was the case that they were a woman before you understood them to be a woman. Appreciate the garland, thank you so much. The same way that when someone comes out as gay, it was the case that they were gay prior to that point, right? They just, your perception of them was that they were straight and now that they're gay. They didn't change, right? That was just your perception of them. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, no, but I'm just saying it's like you're saying that they can't make a choice, but she made that choice, right? Uh, by the way, by the way, um, she uh, apparently to the chat, right? She she still engages with women. Yeah, are you sure about that? That's what I'm people in the chat are saying. Red. Okay, even better, Aaron Hernandez. Aaron Hernandez was gay. I don't what? I don't know about Aaron Hernandez's chose, sexuality. He, Aaron Hernandez is the guy that the football player they made a documentary about him. He was a football player, tremendous football player, killed somebody. Aaron, Aaron Hernandez. Aaron, Her Hernandez. yeah, Aaron Hernandez was was the person who like, mur like literally yeah, m worded so people. Killed somebody like a like a dummy. But look, this guy, he was gay. 
But he chose to like women. He chose to like both. So that's your choice. You chose you choose to like both, and there's nothing Wait, wrong. What are you with talking it. about? Okay, right? Okay, it sounds problem, like they were bi. Right? This is my it sounds problem. like they were bi. Look, look, this is my problem. It's like wait, can, do you think people can be bisexual? For sure. If you want to do it, do it. Go okay, ahead. so so it's no not problem. a choice. It is the case that they just have attraction for both men and women. No, it's a choice. It's like, bro, let's say like you're no. about, let's say you're in a club, right, and you see a man and a woman. And and you're bisexual. Let's say you're bisexual, right? But the man or the girl looks better than the man in the moment. You going for the guy or the girl? You're you would choosing. go for the girl there, right? Because that you're is that is what choosing. your attraction is, right? But mine, can, okay, can, can I please explain? Can I please explain? Can I please explain? Can I please explain? I want you. You're, to you're choosing. You're choosing what desire to act upon. You didn't choose the desire. That's the point I'm getting to. I choose to act upon my desires, but that does not mean I chose my desires. What, bro? No, you chose. No, you chose in that moment. You chose the woman over the man. So you chose. Yeah, I chose what desires to act upon, not the desires in of themselves. No, you chose whether you was gonna be with a man or a woman at night. You made that. Yeah, decision. I chose what desires to act upon, not what desires to have. That makes no sense, bro. I'm not How does that it. make no fucking sense? That is like the, the most clear, basic thing I could have told you ever, man. That makes no sense. In the moment, right? I gave you a scenario. What What is the room temperature, man? Holy shit. Um, in the moment, bro. I gave you a scenario, whether you was going to go for the man or the woman, and you chose. So it is a choice. And there's nothing. But that's the problem, right? It's like you say, I'm saying, oh, it's a problem. I don't like gay people, bro. I got one of my friends that's gay. I, he's a fucking great guy. I don't got a problem with him. I have a problem with the people that's out here eating, eating, eating each other out in the streets. And you're saying, oh, wasn't an adult only event? My guy, that's still bad. Like that's still. I terrible. still wait. No way. I don't. I didn't. I actually didn't disagree with that. Right. Yeah, I said that that sure. still I mean, still wouldn't. should be considered illegal within that context because it relates to arousal. Right. But nudism, like nudism. Right. If we're in an 18 plus setting, just being naked in front of people in an 18 plus setting. Right. There's nothing wrong with that. Bro, that's how. And again, that has nothing to do with that? gay people. What do you mean it has nothing to do with gay people? They're the ones it has nothing to do with gay people it. overall. Wait, if a straight person has sex in public, does that mean that that represents That's all of straight terrible. people? That's terrible. No, but it doesn't represent all of straight people, right? That's terrible. But it doesn't regardless, represent all of straight bro, people. But it's like, okay, but what are you seeing? Are you seeing two people having sex that are that are that are male and female? Are you but it doesn't that? represent straight people, but, right? But what's being pushed on you in the current moment? Does it, no, no, no. Answer my question. Does it does it represent straight people in general? Does it represent straight people? I mean, no, I can't lie. You got me there, but I have a. I, let me just ask you one more question, and then I'll get the fuck up out of here. Cause I see the the guest not, the, the chat not fucking with me. I don't know why. It is what it is. But look, let me ask you this, right? And and this is something that like it doesn't make sense to me, right? So remember when Aiden Ross the other day he uh he posted he was like, oh, mind you, I don't follow Aiden Ross that much. You know, I just he's just a very controversial guy, so you see him a lot. He was said something about like there's only two genders, and people attacked him for that. And you're saying that that's not an agenda when there literally is only two genders. Dude, right, uh, I appreciate the hand massage. Thank you so much, right? I, I believe there are two genders. Oh, oh, do you do? Yes. Thank God, because we agree on something, because there's, you, there's other people in your chat that had you. The cap. Thank like, you so much. Let me ask you something. Bro, I'm not going to lie. Your so chat so nice. people, your chat people, can, here, can I clarify? Can I what's clarify? Up, so, up, so, so genders are going to relate to, right, the expressions in which people have, right, the social and cultural norms in which people are in accordance with, right? People can make claims that there are, like, like three sexes in terms of there being intersex, right? Non-binary itself isn't a gender, by the way. I just want to clarify that, right? But in of itself, right, um, someone who would be intersex, right, if you consider there to be three sexes, right, that wouldn't necessarily be considered a gender, right? Because sex and gender aren't the same thing, right? So gender would be separate from sex. So within this context, there still can be two genders, whereas there could be three sexes, even though actually I, I, I'm not convinced that we would necessarily consider it a third sex, right? Um, it still can be considered like an in-between of the two modes of sex, right? Okay. Um, yeah. Can I ask you a question? I just want to ask you a question, up. right? So a lot of people, you know, people that do believe that there are the, the genders or the pronouns, you know, whatever they want to go by, whatever they want to go by. But when you pull out your ID card, right, to buy whatever you want to buy, what does it say on there? Does it say male or female? Or does it say like, you know, they, them? Or does it um, say they, they, them are pronouns. Ma male and fe female are not pronouns. You get, you get what I'm saying? Um, I, I'm confused what you're saying. Pronouns are separate from from male and female, right? But male no, and but you said that sex and gender are different. But on your, on your um, what you call on your ID, it says sex. No? Yeah, that's that's the way that I define it. On an ID, IDs can define things differently than the way I do, 
right? No, but, but I again, think something that we all go by. That's 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 the world, right? That's the world that we live in. That's descriptively in the world. That doesn't necessarily mean that it correlates to the idea of gender and sex that we would all have. The ideas of gender and sex that we all have don't necessarily relate to again what's just on an ID, right? There could be something on an ID that's not accurate, right? It could be the case on on my ID that my name is not actually my name. Right, like it could just say not that I'm not Parker, right? That I'm some other person's name, right? But it could be the case that uh, I, again I am still Parker, right? So I'd still say that I'm Parker even though my ID says otherwise. I mean, yeah, but what are you legally? Legally, I'm Parker right now. Exactly, that's my I'm, point. I gave a hypothetical. Do you understand what a hypothetical was meant to? Did Did you understand explain? the like forty thousand hypotheticals that I gave you that you deflected? So yeah, I guess we what, both. What 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 hypothetical did I deflect? Name one. Bro, the one that I was telling you, I don't even know. We talked about so much stuff, but let me think about it. Literally, just give me one. It was the one that was making that claim. I've literally, one, like, no, man, I've I actually responded to literally every single thing that I'm you said. I'm definitely not just making that claim. It's the one that we were just you talking are. about when I said that Appreciate you the sale, told, thank you. right? You're in a bar, right? And you see the gay guy. I mean, you see the guy and the girl, and you make the decision, you make the choice, and then somehow you deflect that and you say, "Oh, it's a desire." No, it's bro. It's just that's a not a deflection. That's it's describing, right? I, again, I was I was you giving you the choice, distinction between hold on, hold on. I was giving you the distinction between what you were acting upon there, right? Because you thought that they were choosing their attraction for people, but in that scenario, they were choosing what attraction to act upon. Okay, so I would. That's not a deflection. It's a correction. It's really not a correction. It's the same. It literally shit. is. It bro, literally is a correction. A decision. You're making a decision. Yo, can you, can, you, can to, you look up yo, what bro, deflection means? Let me ask you, son. you go to the store, right? You Man, can you store. look up what deflection you go to the means, store please? And you see M and hey, bro, can you, you say, can you look you up deflect? Can, can you can you can you, hey 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 hey? Before you mute me on some pussy shit, let's go. Go ahead. I, I'm gonna, I, literally. Can you just tell me what deflection means? Bro, deflecting means is that when you get shit thrown at you and you're just deflecting. I know what deflecting means. I'm Tell not, me what deflecting I'm means. Not define have to it. Explain myself to you. Let me ask you a question. No, define it. When you go to the store, define it. If you don't you define it, I will mute you. Define it. Pack of M okay, I'm a, I'm gonna ask you to define it, Mend. Right, Mend. Just literally define it. Right, you're actually deflecting right now, literally by not defining it and by trying to go on to the next thing. So def de stop deflecting, right, and tell me what deflecting means. Bro, deflecting is when people are saying, okay, let's say we're in a room, right? I say in a room, right? And I know that you're right, but I keep changing the subject. That's exactly what the flex so, so that's not what I was doing. I wasn't changing the subject. I was relating to the example. I was explaining something, correcting you with the example. That's not changing the, the, the topic. For sure, right? For sure. But my question is that you just completely went over, which you deflected right then and there. No, I you were deflecting away from me by trying to ask me this question, right? So now I'll answer your question because you were deflecting, not me. So let me ask you a question. So if you go to the store, right, and you see a pack of M&M, you see a pack of Skittles. Are you not making a choice in that, in that situation? Or is it your desire to eat chocolate? So I didn't choose, like, whether or not my taste buds like M&Ms or Skittles more. I chose which one to pick or which one to act upon. Appreciate the galaxy. Thank you so much. Appreciate the hand heart. This is actually perfect, right? You just gave me a perfect analogy for this. Are you saying that you chose for your taste buds to like M&Ms or to like Skittles more? Of course. I think that's wild, right? Yeah, okay, then why, why can't I choose to find vegetables, uh, vegetables tasty? I mean, that's just you, bro. We all like what we each his own. So you, you, can know, choose, you can choose to find any food tasty? You definitely can if you eat it long enough. Okay, okay. Can you choose to find feces tasty? That, that's just not even eatable. What are you talking about? Talk about no, it is. It is literally. Food. Can you choose so you to find shit. feces tasty? You would eat shit. Let me ask you that question. You're no, I would not. Can you okay, choose to so find feces tasty? Me, let me. Why are you asking me if I would find it tasty? Hey, can can you, you choose to find feces? Me. Can you choose to find feces um, tasty? Um, do you find your own shit tasty? No, I don't. I don't eat shit. How much do you eat shit? Because you're asking me if I eat can shit. Can you, dude, man, you're not understanding my point. Bro, I, I, let me tell you. Is there you. any food that you don't like? I completely understand what you're saying. Okay, look, when Is I was Is there any kid, food you don't like? When I was younger, right, I hated celery. Bro, I fucking eat celery like it's nothing now. Y it's yeah, because your taste buds changed. Yeah, they right? changed over time. You didn't choose. Lazy Bones, I appreciate the subscription. Thank you so much. You didn't no, choose for them to, to eat it. Can I, can I, let me, let me, let me get this out. Or I'm gonna, do I have to mute you every single time I speak, bro? Right, so you, you didn't choose to change them. They changed based upon your development. My fault. Was that change upon my development? No, they just they change, change based upon your development. No, yes. Because I, I, okay, perfect. Okay, here we go. In the moment, right? Let's say, okay, so they they do change over time, and I'm not disagreeing with you, but let me ask you that question. In the moment, would I have known that my taste buds changed if I hadn't made the choice to pick up the celery?
that's choosing to act upon Do desires. Do I look at something and be like, yo, that shit tastes good if I didn't like it before? No, you can try to taste it and you can try to see if you like it or not, right? But you you won't know in, you, until you or if you like it or not until you taste it in that scenario. Because your taste buds can change. Yeah, now, I don't think the same thing choice. is true with sexuality, but like I'm when it relates to choice. taste buds, hold up, when it relates to taste buds, um, clearly speaking... All right. Um, you're not choosing whether or not you find something like tasty. Okay. Can you choose to find metal tasty? Like when you lick metal, can you choose to find that like tasty? I don't know. Do you choose to find that mic tasty? No, I can't choose to find any of that. Exactly. Tasty. Because that's not eatable, my guy. We're talking about stuff that's eatable. edible. Edible. Let's just, let's just again, by on. the way, let's it doesn't have to be on. edible. Hold up. It doesn't have to be edible for you to find it tasty or not. Right. For example, right. Um, uh, if you lick something and it's not edible, it can still taste good or taste bad. We're just talking about the taste, We're right? It, it is, it is true that it's not edible to say, eat, um, I don't know what the fuck. Um, it's not edible to eat, um, I'm trying to think like a, like a tissue paper and it also tastes bad. Yeah. This shit is just nasty. I mean, I don't know why you would do that. You eat, you eat tissue paper. No, I, I don't eat tissue paper, dude. Okay, so I like I understand your point, but it's like, what the fuck are we talking about? Let, let me just, I right, look, look, let me get. I'm, the I'm just t saying that you can't choose what what you like in terms of or what you desire in terms of your taste buds, right? But you can no, choose to act upon can. those desires. But let me. See, but you see how you could, Minty? Well, wait, you see how you can choose? Can I ask you a question? So your brain, right? Your brain makes up these desires, right? Yeah, you just have how these desires you, in your brain. You, Actually, think, I think it might think be related. Get, how do you think people get addicted to shit? Addictions aren't desires. Addictions do relate to desires, yeah, and actually okay, addiction so, is oftentimes genetic, so right? Bro, and it's it's related yeah, to I'm, like I'm a aware, biological I'm response. Well Minty, if you don't if you don't stop talking, I'm gonna mute you. I'm well aware of that, bro. Go ahead. What you want to say, bro? Yeah. So. Because it's like I'm trying to say something, and then you cut me off, and then you cut me off, and then I cut you off. It's like we do a cycle. Yeah, because you constantly are cutting me off. That's I the only know. reason. With all due respect, go ahead. I honestly don't remember what I was saying. Can you remind me? We were talking about celery and shit. Uh, I, I was just talking about how you can't choose your taste buds. You can choose to act upon them, right? But you can't choose your taste. No, 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 no. But then, oh, no, no. We weren't even talking about that, bro. We were talking about the addictions. Basically, what I was just trying to say was you can train your brain to like something. You know what I mean? Is, is, that, not, is that not correct? No, that's a biological response to a particular drug. Oh, my God. This is ridiculous. It is. It is. It is a biological response. Jesus Christ. All right, yeah, you know it all, my guy. Let me just, let me just. End I don't, this. I don't know it all. It shit is wild because no, you can literally train your brain to like something if you do it enough every day, which you shouldn't. All right, all right. So train your brain to like men right now. Fuck no, baby. Because you well, can't fucking do it. Well, never in my life. But let me ask you a question, right? Because you can't fucking do it. Let me ask you one question. I mean, now nah, let me, let me, let me just. You feel me? Let me end it with this, right? This is my point, bro. Cause the shit, this shit got a little shaky. I ain't gonna lie, when shit get a little shaky for me, I lose my, I lose my temper. I stop, I stop thinking, right? But let me, let me just tell you, I'm calm. Let me just, let me end it with this, right? So basically, bro, my, my original statement when I came up here, listen, bro, I don't, I don't, I like, bro, I don't dislike gay people. I don't have a problem with them. As a matter of fact, I think it's like sad when I see that they're just getting beat up on for no fucking reason. That's just not right. You know what I mean? Cause I'm a Christian, and Christians, you know, you're not supposed to beat up on somebody else. You know what I mean? Do Christians like, use the Lord name in vain? Bro, but you want to talk about sinning, bro? Well, you you used the Lord name in vain earlier in your Christian. You want to talk, you want to talk about sinning, bro? People sin every day, bro. People sin every day, respectfully, bro. Like, just you just got to get right with God, but that, we're not talking about that. Can I finish my statement? Yeah, so yeah, get, get right with God and not stop using the, the Lord's name in vain, though. Or are you gonna, are you gonna keep just cutting me off? All right, cool. That's what I was trying to say. Pretty much, bro. My original statement when I came up here was the thing about it is, bro, it's like. I don't dislike gay people. I like them. They're cool, bro. Like, I don't have a problem. I see them as regular human beings. I just don't like when all this shit is being forced upon everybody. You can't force something on somebody and then, like, expect people to be like, oh, yeah, what the fucking do? Like, you don't see, like, the NFL. I don't know if you watch football, but I'll bring it up for the people in the chat. Bro, you don't see this shit that they're pushing with, like, Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey right now? It's like, yo, bro, the Dolphins just hung up 70 points on a football team and all they've been posting about is Taylor Swift like we give a fuck but that, that's my point though that's my point you know what I mean it's like they're pushing shit on people it's like yo you don't gotta push something because they're already accepted in my in my mind bro they're accepted I don't have a problem with them like I, that shit doesn't bother me you know what I mean it's just more so like when it's in my face 
and you see people eating each other out, and then you got the gay people holding signs like, oh, yeah, we're coming for your kids, we're coming for your kids. You can search it up. That was the Canada ones. So, you know, I'm not, you know, you think I'm lying all the time, but you see people, oh, we're coming for your kids, we're doing that. I don't like that shit, but what if I have a child? I want my child to live the way I live and just and just relax, you, you know? If he's gay, oh, my God, it's the end of the fucking world. No, like, it doesn't matter. I want him to make that decision on his own, not go to school and the teachers put it on him. Let him make that decision on his own or her, whoever is, whatever it's going to be, you know what I'm saying? God bless his soul, whatever it ends up being. It's just like, let him, let them make that decision on their own and not, yo, let me just go to school. Like, you know, let me, I'm gonna send my, like, I don't wanna be afraid to send kids to school, bro, they gotta go to learn, you know what I mean? Not go to learn about like fucking political shit. Bro, when, when was the first time you heard about something political in school? Like, honestly speaking, they didn't start, to, the first political thing I heard about in school was probably, um, you know, rest in peace to everybody that died that day, but the, the, um, the Boston bombings, remember the marathons? Yeah, that was around first grade for me. We did like a we did like an election thing. Nah, that was around where, like fourth grade uh, for me. For me, where we so. voted for me. For me, it was first grade. We nah, did no way, bro. You're, you're older than me for sure. Look it up. It was around like 2013. Or hey, 2011. can I like? I mean, no, you're just wrong. That was the first time you did I'm, it. Can I'm I like? Trying, I'm just trying to help. I understand what you're gonna say. I'm not like trying to cut you off. I'm just saying like I I just want you to know that. No, you're you right. actually are right now. Search it up. Search it up. Because there's no way that I'm a kindergartner and I'm paying attention to that shit. So just search it up, please. So, so, so Search everybody up what, I'm dude? I, I'm literally telling you about what I went through, right? Can I please? Oh, no, yeah. No, go ahead. Go ahead. Yo, are you talking about oh, the same incident as me? No. Oh, that's why. Okay. So, yeah, my fault. Go ahead. I'm telling you the first thing I heard it. We yeah, did like yeah, a voting yeah, okay. thing in 2008, right? In first grade, right? About who we would vote for. That's it. Okay. Um, so, we can, let, me, let, me, let me relate to this. Okay. So, if you want people to make their own decision, say being gay and being straight is acceptable and let them make their own decision. Of course. In terms bro. of in terms of in terms of who they are, then if you think of it's a course. choice, let them make their own decision in terms of what it is. Right? Just say that it's acceptable to be both gay and be straight. Of course. And then I see. Hold on, one second. But I that's literally what they're that's literally what they're saying, and that's what you were like arguing against. Stop forcing it upon us, right? It's literally just saying being gay is acceptable. Um, it's bro, it's one hundred percent acceptable. But why you gotta force it? Why you can't just be like like you know? That's not forcing it. It's bro, how is it, it not forcing it? How? How? Just please answer me. So you saying to accept so gay people right? is not forcing it. Bro, you're looking up. You're just chilling, right, in school, and then you got you're doing whatever the fuck. You're cracking a joke with one of your friends, and then they pass you a, sh a fucking paper about your sexuality, and you're like nine years old. That's not gonna rub you the wrong way. Can Can you give me one place that did that? What do you think's happening in schools right now, bro? Give me Give me one school this system, the, one teacher, one place where that up, happened. My guy, like, wake up! What do you? One doing? place. Give me one place. Think about it. Look it up. Go ahead. Look it up. No, no, no. You give me one place. You made the claim. Look it up. One place. And that's what I said to you. Look it up. G give me where to look up. Give I me the title. I, worked, I told you I worked in a school, and you give must me have give me the that. title. You must have give forgot me one, about that. One, that I one in one place. School. You must have forgot that I worked in a school, and I told you. Yeah, and in that school, did it have this particularly? Did I not just tell you that there were posters on the wall? Poster on the wall is not the same thing as you getting an assignment in class. Okay, so if poster on the wall on the saying wall. it's acceptable to be gay. If you don't, if there's you nothing don't, wrong with that. Actually, you, see, you, you he like you see how he just like constantly cuts me off. Like it's actually unbelievable, dude. I have to mute you. Like I have to treat you like a child on my live. I can't like just have a conversation with you. I have to mute you. Like literally every single time I talk. Not nah, facts. Yeah, I literally have to treat you like a child. Facts, facts, facts. Go ahead, say what you want. I to never say. mute people on my live. This is like really sad. Like I'm not joking. Like. If you have to, if you get muted on my live multiple times, right, you have some real issues with having to talk over people, right? because I I have an exorbitant amount of patience that I give to people fuck. in terms that of I, them. There are issues on some that I should. You see how he's still cutting me off? That don't give a fuck. That, that don't give a fuck. So exactly. Fuck. So I'll do the exact same thing to you, right? Ahead, Would you like please. me to cut you off constantly? Nah, bro, but it's like Scott, yo, your boy. I appreciate the subscription. Thank you so much. Off. Yeah, appreciate. No, I will cut you off. I'll keep cutting you off as yo, much as I want because yo, you're the one cutting me off. Congratulations on your on your mill likes, bro. Thank like, you so much. Appreciate it, bro. Appreciate it. See how we can agree to shit and not cut each other off. You cut me off. I cut you no, off. No, I will. I'm gonna cut you off as much as I want because you keep cutting me off. No, but yeah, bro, we're doing. We're both cutting each other off. So I'm. Gonna yeah, cut only you because off. you're cutting me off. Look, I was literally not cutting you off. I was not cutting you off at all, right? And you, at that same time as me not cutting you off, you still right kept cutting me off. Appreciate right, the hand Thank you so much. Look, look, from now on, let's not cut each other off. Deal? Deal. All right, bet. Let's do it. What are you going to say? Go for it. I, you were talking, bro. No, it's your turn. Because I just, I told, I said what I said. What'd you say? With what part? Uh, I ain't going to lie for God, man.
Let, listen, Pedro, bro, let's, so say what you think. Let's just, let's just exit. Let's get somebody else up in here. But um, I think this was pretty fun for the most part. Right, for sure. I appreciate the hanging lights. Thank you so much. We're going to go to the next person. Only send a guest request. If you disagree, tap that screen, everyone. Let's try to get to 2 million likes. If you want to help get it out to more people, share the live. Let's try to get to 2K shares. If you like this type of content, follow me. If you haven't already, I go live literally every single day. Let's go to the next person. Only send a guest request. If you disagree, thank you for the superpower. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thank you for the mic drop as well. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Yo, what's up? How old are you? Hello? Yo, hello? How old are you? 19. Do you think that being gay is wrong or immoral? I mean... Appreciate that mustache. Thank you so much. Wrong? I mean... I, I guess, kind of. Why so? Because, like, God puts you on the earth to be, like, male or female, not gay. You, know uh, you can like, be male or female and still be gay. Um, those things aren't mutually exclusive. I know, uh, but... Like, and two, Chris, I appreciate the galaxy. Thank you so much. I appreciate gay, it. Gay is haram. You know what I'm saying? So what's the justification for the Quran describing what's right and wrong about morality? Appreciate the sunglasses. It's just haram. So can you give me a justification for the Quran? Um, I have no idea, but everyone. Yeah, so to this. this is going to be akin to me saying that like uh, the, the universe was created by me having an omnitrix, slamming the omnitrix like I'm Ben 10, Ben Tennyson, right? And then creating the universe by that. And then I am the one that determines the morality of this universe. So being gay isn't wrong. Gay, being gay is wrong. Like, you don't see them parades and shit? Like, what the fuck is that? That's uh, what like, mean, what's wrong with riots pride and shit? Like, y'all don't look normal. Y'all look like freaks. Like, the, the normal, like, person wouldn't be gay. Like, I feel like it's like the people that be, like, doing COVID vaccines and shit. Uh, normal people are gay. I, I'm normal people are gay because it is normal to be gay. Um, nah, secondly, no, when it re- secondly, when it relates gay. to this, when it relates to this, most people got vaccinated. So the normal person got vaccinated. You're abnormal if you didn't get vaccinated. Um, if you if you can medically speaking. Nah, nah. Wait, are you gay? Actually, you're the abnormal one. But um, no, I'm not gay. Oh, you're not gay then. <laughs> then well, why am I doing this? Because I don't think gay. that gay people should be discriminated, hated, or targeted in negative ways. I think that there's an unjustified premise for considering gay to be wrong. I, people think people should critically think. And clearly speaking, people who hold this position don't seem to be critically thinking. Wait, <laughs> wait are you a Christian? No. What are you? like? I'm agnostic atheist. What? Means I don't know if a god exists and I don't believe a god. Mm. So that's why you're sticking up for gay people. Because, and like... If you believed in God, you wouldn't be gay. Um, gay people will still believe in God. That's that still exists. Appreciate the hand, hand art. Thank you so much. But yeah, I think there's an unjustified premise for for any of those Abrahamic religions. I think that there are contradictions within the worldview. So, yeah, I think that they're just wrong. Nah, gay people are just faggots. Oh, uh, you have no argument. You just can say slurs. No argument. Uh, that's a that's a fucking great. That's a great great little point there. Literally, can just say slurs. Literally just can say slurs. That's all he got. Tap the screen, everyone. Let's try to get to 2 million likes. Yo, what's up? How old are you? How old are you? 19. Can you hear me? Yeah, for sure. Do you think that being gay is wrong or moral? Yes. Why so? You're paused, by the way, so I can't hear you. What'd you say? You're paused. Do you think that being gay is wrong or moral? Yes, I do. Can you hear me? Yeah, why do you think it's wrong? Um. Well, just to start, like, I'm a Christian, right? So, like, my, uh, my worldview, that's just a part of it. Like, I believe that a man should be with a woman and a woman should be with a man. And, like, that's the end of it for me. But, like, in, in my mind, like, I, I don't have a problem with gay people. I just have a problem with, you know, that um, group of people, like, flaunting it at your face. Like... And and by the way, like in person, that has happened to me. I'm speaking from experience. Like, there's been times, you know, I live in New York City, so there's been times where like, I'll just be walking down the street, and then I'll be fucking uh, flags will literally be thrown in my face, and people will be yelling at me that they're gay. And I just find it like that. There's a lot of people within that. Um, the the gay community that think that it's right or okay to like flaunt that their sexuality and and by the way i think it's the same thing for straight people like if you're straight and you 
like flaunt your sexuality in people's faces, I think that's wrong too. Okay, so um, when you relate to this, you just said like someone like threw a flag at you and was screaming at you to be like that they're gay. Bro, it happens all the time in New York City, bro. I know people that live in New York City. That does not happen all the time. Uh, it certainly does, bro. There, there are parades That's not true. constantly. There are protests. Um, I stay. There are at parades and protests in every city, right? Where do you go that has this all the time? Like, what do you mean? Like, name where the street. Am I? Yeah, name the street. Like Columbus in New York Circle, City. Columbus Circle, one Central Park West. All right, that's the street that happens all the time. Uh, there are often people that walk where I'm walking, and, and also like. If you live in New York City, there are City, people that walk know. where you're walking. Yeah, of course. Yeah, bro. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> what about the people walking where you're walking? <laughs> what about the people walking where I'm walking? I'm just saying, like, it's very common for that to happen. Like, it's just a city. There's is, is it a particular in, Pride event, or does this happen like daily? Please don't interrupt me. There's like 11 million people within a 11 mile radius. Of course, they're gonna be. That shit's gonna happen. They're crazy people. Yeah, so is it daily? No, of course not. So it's on Pride events? Sorry? Like you're, are, so are you So it's during Pride events? That or just like one time I was in Chicago and uh I was just leaving my hotel and there there was just this guy that came up to me. He was in like booty shorts and By the way, so that's not all the time, right? So your claim that it was all the time, right? Is not true because you just said it was particular to Pride events, okay? No, I um, didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, you did. You're twisting my you words. Said no. it, you just said, said it wasn't I daily, said, and you said it was during Pride events. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. I never said it was daily. I did say yes during You said it Pride wasn't events, daily. But not li no, I did yes. say yes. It happens during Pride events, but it is not limited to Pride events. Okay. Um, does it happen daily? No. I already said that. You asked me Yeah, you just, you just said I didn't say that it, it wasn't daily. That's what you just said. So you just contradicted yourself twice, but okay. Um, what are you talking so, about? So the idea here is that um, you came on live and you're flaunting the fact that you're Christian. All right. The Not first thing that you said on my just live. My worldview. Yeah, but I mean, I mean, people are just explaining their sexuality. Right, and you asked me why is being gay wrong, and I explained that my set of beliefs includes that a man should be with a woman and a woman should be with a man. That is just my religion. That's my worldview. That's how I view things. Yeah, but it's you could have decided not to come on the live and flaunt it in front of people. I'm, I, I don't think you're really listening, bro. I'm not flaunting anything. I'm just explain. I'm answering your question. What does it mean to flaunt? Why are you asking me definitions? Like, I know what flaunt means. That's just a backhanded question. Like, that's. Can you just tell me very, what it means? That's very convenient for you to ask. Like, I'd, of course, I don't know the definition of flaunt, and I can see you probably searching it up on your phone right now. Oh, yeah. I, I don't know the definition of flaunt off the top of my head. So uh, when, you, when you say flaunt, right, it seems like we're displaying something like um, ostentatiously, which is essentially saying like in a pretentious or showy way designed to impress, right, especially in order to provoke envy or admiration uh, or to show de de uh, defiance, right? Um, so in, in this scenario, right, uh, it seems like one, we could say that there's not some type of um, like a, like flaunting that is happening here, right? Or if you do consider that there is flaunting, right, it sounds like the same thing would then apply to your world, to what you just said, right? Because it sounds like you were doing this to provoke an envy or an admiration or to show de defiance here, right? Because you're disagreeing. Right. Yeah. I mean, of course, like a synonym of flaunting is going to be something I just said is going to apply to what I said. But again, as I said, I wasn't flaunting my religion. I was explaining. I don't really know why you keep coming back to flaunting. Well, under that definition, it sounds like you were because you were doing so to show defiance in terms of disagreement. Um, defiance is different than disagreement, bro. What does defiance mean? Being defiant is like being rebellious. You're openly resistant to the point that I'm posing. Right. Being, but being defiant, it, it, the way people use defiant is similar to rebellious. And I'm not being rebellious. I'm just disagreeing. You are to my point. Okay. So technically under this definition, you did just flaunt it. Right. So it doesn't really seem like you think flaunting is necessarily a bad thing. 
I, I mean, I don't really, <laughs> I'll be honest, I don't really understand why you keep bringing up flaunting. We already established that I wasn't flaunting my religion. I was just answering your question. No, I think, I think it's clear that it sounds like under, under that definition you are. Okay. Uh, believe what you want to believe. Do you, do you think being gay is wrong? No. Are you gay? No. Okay. Okay. I mean, like, yeah. I mean, I, to be clear, like, as I said before, I don't have a problem with gay people. It's just that I believe that, like, a man should be with a woman and a woman should be with a man and it shouldn't be any other way. And I do think that, like, the media tries to, I have a question for you. Like, would you agree that the general media attempts to, um, what's the word, like, part society almost for their own gain by using um by like almost inflating situations pertaining to like sexuality and like that type of shit to provoke people sorry can you say that one more time here by the way can you just can you just say what your birth year is because people in the comment section are like spamming that you're underage my birth year I, yeah. I, i'm 19. what's your birth year my birth year, uh, 2004, January okay. 13th, 2004. Yeah, that's fine. So chat, I don't, I don't know why people are. I just, my voice that. isn't that deep. Yeah, no, it's fine. Go for it. Say what you're saying. I kind of forgot to be honest. The birth no, I apologize. year. So, so it sounded like you were saying that like, it shouldn't be any other way than man and woman. And I would just ask you why is that related to your religion? How does that relate to how does that relate to my religion? Well, in my religion, I said, is right? it related to your religion? Is meaning is my point of view on gay, being gay wrong have to do with my religion? Is that what you're asking? Is that what it's grounded in, yeah. or is it grounded in some other reason? I mean, the one of the main reasons why I believe that, yes would be because of my religion but like also i just think that like ethically it's wrong and why is that i don't know i just like i don't know i don't know why it's wrong it's just wrong so like if i consider it's wrong to be straight and i just i, I guess, don't know why I mean, like is that justified yeah like you you got me right there i kind of was like lost for words like you definitely got me right there but Okay. Sorry, I kind of interrupted you. What did you say before? Oh, I didn't really say anything there. Um, so it just it just it just sounds like uh, sounds like a like we don't have a justification here for why being gay is wrong. Appreciate the little crown. Thank you so much. Seems like you have an unjustified premise for considering it to be wrong. I mean, uh, maybe to you that's what you think, but you didn't say anything. So I I I have a question. Do you think that it is like ethically okay for? school systems to talk about sexuality with kids and teach about sexuality at a young age like before like i don't know it was a while ago but like like before high school yeah since like adolescent minds are very the fuck? Like, i do i learned uh, i learned about it in conservative christian iowa in sixth grade in fifth grade I learned about the anatomy, right? So just saying like boys yeah, can like course, boys, like girls yeah, can right, like right, girls. Right, but... Wait, hold up, hold up. Just saying boys can like boys, girls can like girls, and girls can like boys, and boys can like girls. There's nothing wrong with that either. All right, that makes sense to say to children. Obviously, as you get older, there'd be, there'd be a lot more information that's given because it could relate to like teen no, pregnancy, yeah, other stuff like that. Right, yeah. I mean, obviously, like anatomy should be taught and that type of stuff, but like what i'm what i was saying is what my question was cuz you kind of deflected it there is do you think that it is okay for sexuality to be taught to kids like below the age of like 14 or 15 excluding anatomy because like obviously like we need to learn about our bodies to f properly function and and to be yeah, clear some I'm boys not, like boys some um, girls like girls some boys like girls and some limited, girls like hold boys on, hold on, hold on. i'm not specifically limiting that to being straight or gay i'm saying in general like regardless like i don't think in my personal opinion i don't think that 
um, that people, sh or sorry, teachers should like teach young kids about sexuality because as kids, you're very curious and you, it is very easy to like adopt a certain set of beliefs as a kid because you don't have many life experiences to like really understand what's right and what's wrong. Like, okay. So should we not put, should we not show kids religion? I mean, I really think it depends on like your household. Like me, I was born into a Christian household and I'm grateful that I was taught religion or I was taught. But, but you couldn't determine what was right or wrong. So why was it okay for them to like push that on you? Well, I was never uh, religion wasn't pushed on with me. It was. Wait, just but you taught. were a kid; you couldn't rationalize it. You were just taught. Okay, so the same thing could be true. Like, if it's not being pushed on you, well, then it's not being pushed on kids in the school system. It's just being taught. Sorry, well, I ha I got a phone call while you were saying that. Yeah, so so they're not being pushed. It's, it's not being pushed upon uh, kids in terms of saying that it's acceptable to be gay or sexuality or anything like that. It's just being taught to them. Yeah. Okay. All right. <laughs> not, Seems I'm like you have so nothing sorry, nothing bro. against this, so. No, 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 I do. I'm very sorry. I'm very sorry, but I I like I'm I'm, I'm sorry to like say this, but I lost focus for a second. I'm really sorry. I know that was rude, okay. but but like to expand on what you were saying before, right? Um uh, before you interrupted me with um you asked me do I think it's okay? You know, or sorry, I said that I think it's wrong that, um, or I think it would be wrong to teach young kids about sexuality. Um, and then you decided to ask me if I think it should be wrong to teach religion since it's a very similar topic or whatever. And my response to that is no, because religion and sexuality are two completely different things. And sexuality is not a set of beliefs or a worldview or, you know, et cetera. And I remember hearing you say you were an atheist earlier in a, in a previous, the previous person. So like, I think it'd be hard to debate you about this, but growing up Christian and being taught religion, right? That religion, not only was I taught about or not only did I learn about like, you know, like what we're talking about right now, but you also learn about things like, you know, wisdom that's passed down for thousands of years and stories and tales. And like okay, that. Bro, that bro's like, lagging a lot. Are you there, bro? Would otherwise you wouldn't learn if. Yeah, yeah you were, you were lagging a lot. So, um, I'm asking you very clearly for the relevant distinction. I appreciate Lena. Thank you for the hand art. Thank you so much between religion in terms of teaching this to children and in terms of saying it's acceptable to be gay to say that one is acceptable to teach children, but the other one is not. What well, the, as I said before, like they're two completely different things. Like religion and sexuality are completely different. Being gay is is talked about in the Bible, like, like, um, being attracted to the same sex is spoken about in the Bible, but it is not, it can't like sexuality can't be compared to the Bible and an entire religion. I'm asking you, like, what is the relevant difference between these two things that means that you cannot compare the two? Various things such as like wisdom and stories and explanations for how we've been created and like you know life after death etc like sexuality is completely oh i fucking like guys i'd like girls or i'm a guy and i like a guy or i'm a girl and i like a girl or i'm a guy and i like both or like whatever that it's completely different than religion like this you can't even have a conversation dude i'm asking debate. twitch yeah. twitch dude i'm i'm literally saying what's relevantly different in terms of comparing it within this respect okay i'm not asking you what some differences are in general i'm asking you what's relevantly different okay you saying that there are moral teachings within it right i can bring up a religion that there are moral teachings within it that say that you know you know being gay is fine being gay is good 
right? For example, Shmeezianity, right? Shmeezianity teaches that being gay is good. I mean, I, I would disagree that being gay is good, honestly. Chat, chat, why are y'all saying he's 16? What the fuck? Chat, if you keep spamming that, I'm going to literally block you off if you don't know that. Like, why, chat, Yo, why are y'all spamming I that? Are you, are you lying about your age? Are you lying about your age? No, bro. January 13th. Why, why does your YouTube and Facebook say you're 16? Bro, what are you talking about? That's I don't have just a said. Facebook. I don't have a Facebook and my age isn't on my YouTube. Okay. So I don't have I don't, a Facebook. Y'all have someone else. His family else. wished him a happy birthday 16? On what? On what, chat? Y'all, I, I don't know where you're getting this. There, there's so many people saying I might just have to do that. Nah, Parker, hold on, bro. Hold on. I have something to say. Like, if you think, if you, I already told you my birthday and everything. Feel free to go to my Instagram and, I mean, I don't think I have Here, I'll my check it right now. Let me, let me do it myself. Okay. All right, is your Instagram you think, linked to your I have TikTok? I question for you, though, real quick. Yeah. Do you think being gay is good? Do I think being gay is good? Yeah, do you think being gay is a good thing? Um, I don't think it's considered yeah, chat, right. Or... Chat. Y'all, chat, make sure you spam that like button. Let's get to 1.5 mil, guys. Okay, so I don't think it's considered right or wrong, right? The same way I don't consider being straight to be right or wrong. Okay. Yeah, chat, on what picture does it say that, by the way, everyone? I don't see it on his Instagram. Hey, while you're on my Instagram, uh, feel free to hit that follow button. <laughs> I'm cringing. <laughs> I, have to, I have to get that plug in real quick. Appreciate the crown. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, guys. Bro, scroll down on which chat, one, chat? His tags? Your chat is trolling, by the way. I don't have anything posted regarding my... Um, Regarding my age on Bertha, there. yeah, all right. All right, well, I think they're lying, right? Uh, if, by the way, everyone, yeah. if you say 16 now, I'm going to, I'm literally just going to, I'm going to have mods mute you, okay? Um, unless you have good reason to believe it, I'm just going to have mods mute you. Because that can actually, like, I don't know. That can actually yeah, fuck guys, up that's, that's the shit, right. so. Yeah, No, if you literally um, say 16, you're going to get muted, so. Yeah. Um, hey, chat, by the way, make sure you guys spam uh, roses and hit that Mods, button. mods, go ahead and mute all those people. And uh, hit that like button, guys, so we can get this live. You know, I do lives. I'm not trying to plug right now, but I do lives right now, too. Yo, this, so. Uncle, I appreciate the, appreciate the subscription. Thank you so much. But anyway, let's get back into the debate. So, you know, maybe you started off with asking a new question. I'd like to move on because I don't think that we can compare. Um, thanks for the likes on the Instagram, guys. Um, I don't think that we can compare religion to sexuality as I established before previously. So well, respect it, my instead comparing. of just inst instead of just arguing and getting nowhere with that, let's just move on to a new question. Thank you for this one. I appreciate topic. it. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, so like when it relates to that, um, uh, I, I think you're not understanding what I'm comparing. In that scenario, I was comparing, again, right, uh, what uh like what you're teaching children and whether or not you teaching that to them is like forcing it upon them so if you don't think it's forcing religion upon people to teach them religion then it's not forcing being gay upon people just to teach being accepting of gay people and the thing is these two aren't even comparable within the respect that right one of them isn't just teaching to be acceptable of this particular religion right the, and um it's it's saying that you ought to believe these particular characteristics right that's the claim so clearly speaking i'm going to say here that like it, this saying it's acceptable to be gay would be comparable to saying it's acceptable to be Christian, right? Within that respect, right? Teaching mm -hmm. kids that. And I think that we should teach kids that it's acceptable to be Christian in a moral sense, right? I think it's unjustified, but it's acceptable, right? I'm not going to say that you're morally wrong. I mean, I mean unless you refer to something that I would clearly right. disagree with, but. Right. Yeah. Um, hold on one second. Good night. Very, very loud. All right, I'll be quiet. Love you. Good night. Um, <laughs> sorry guys. Anyway, so, um, where were we again? Oh yeah, I had a qu I had a question for you. I, I wanted to make a point. So when you were uh talking with Mindia Business, that guy before, you were. Well, I, have a, um, I have a question. Are you done with high school? Right now? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mhm. Mm you live at home. Yeah, I do. Okay. I'm not going to college yet. I started a business. I'm from home right now. I started streaming and I started a business on the side. 
Hello. Yeah, can you hear me? Yeah. Go ahead. Hello. Can you hear me? Yeah, your 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 internet's sucking, man. All right. So anyway, so yeah, my bad, my bad. I think it's fixed now. Anyway, so I I want to make a point before. So you um you were when you were streaming with Mindy 